I'm gonna take my motor, I'm gonna throw it up into the back of this truck, and glue it in, and then it'll be time to go for a ride. Well, I've got it outside. Wait. Right, well I did take it outside, and then I brought it back in. I'm on this side of the barn now, where I will be adding a transmission, and then I'll be taking it outside and putting it in the slag hack. One way or the other. I'm gonna get it in there or I'm gonna die trying. I have no idea what I'm doing. There it is, my engine's installed. Well, not quite. Well, this is a little bit of a disaster. At the moment, it's stuck. Well, this kind of sucks. I got the transmission hung up on the frame. I had trouble breaking it loose, so I decided to wiggle, jerk, wiggle, wiggle, jerk, jerk, wiggle, wiggle, jerk. That method proved to be successful, although now I have a, a, a slight hole in the transmission. So at this point, most people would abort the mission, pull it back out, throw the transmission case in the garbage, and probably start over or get a new hobby, maybe buy a boat. I think I'll carry on with the mission and glue it together. Where there's a weld, there's a way. It'll be okay. Definitely not the right spot. This is a mild disaster in the making. At this point, it seems fairly apparent that no one's ever had a motor this wide in this truck. It doesn't fit. Um jammed up against I'm jammed up against those cross members up there and back here if I look if I were to lower it down I'd have to get this cross member and this shit out of the way so it's gonna be one or the other well I just got to figure out which section of the frame I'm gonna take the torch to and that'll be that with this story I got to cut the frame apart to get this motor in less cross members in the way let's see if I can get this thing straightened out without ruining too much other stuff just when things were looking real good it turns out the motor mounts are in the wrong spot and I've got to hack them off the frame now and reposition. Just like a beaver loaded up on Adderall and Lunchables, I'm gonna chop this truck apart. How's your day going so far?
A wise man once told me, if you do what you love for a living, you'll never work a day in your life. Well, nobody's paying me to do this as of yet, but the way I figure most people would consider this hard labor, and I just consider it having a good time out in the sun. What I gotta do now is weld these motor mounts in and make this a permanent deal. You know, when I was a kid, they told me if I did drugs, I'd be scrambling my brain up, making scrambled eggs. Now, everywhere I go, people are trying to shoot me up full of government drugs. I don't understand. Maybe they want to scramble my eggs. Perhaps they've already been scrambled. What are your eggs looking like these days, son? Mm. <laughs> All right, watch out. Sparks are going to fly and babies are going to cry. What? I asked you, brother, what's a snorl? A snorl?